Hi. Reborn family, how are y'all? Well, it's almost 2 o'clock in the a.m. So I'm sitting here and I'm rooting hair. Um, on my Caucasian baby. I'm working on her baby hairs. Doing that. Um, this is my first time rooting with human hair. And I must say, I really do like it, you know, um, I don't have to use the magnifying lamp, which is, um, you can see that, but I can use the light on the lamp, but I don't have to use the magni uh, magnifying part of it, because it's thick enough to where I can, you know, see where I want the hairs, so... I'm so anxious, I want to get this head done fast, because it's a bigger doll, and my first Caucasian baby, and I can't wait to put it together, put the body on it, it it's the Easton kit, six months, and... I want to do the baby hairs and I want to do her eyebrows and then I don't have much to go once I do that the back of the head but I um I think she's going to be so cute you can see how she's been rooted a little bit one to two hairs um, per plug now, most people, they do the swirl. I don't, I don't particularly care for the swirl because then you have to comb the hair and you have, in that one spot. So I just like the, the hair to kind of be free and you can just comb it any way you want to or part it if need be. So that's what I prefer. Um, maybe one day I'll try, you know, the squirrel, but I am a beginner and I'm still, I am learning. Um, it's, it's been fun learning. I have a long ways to go, but each doll I'm getting better. That's the main thing. So I'm not buying real expensive kits, you know. So, for the most part, I get most of my kids from Bountiful Baby, and I did splurge a little bit. I went, um, I went, oh. I, I've always liked the Saskia, is that my center right Saskia kit? So, I, I wanted two, so I ordered one because I want them to be twins. Um, twins run in my family. I had twin uncles, I have twin brothers. I have twin niece and nephews, and I like twins. Then I see that um, Bonnie, was that her name, Bonnie Brown? She has the, the Sas Saskia series. So I decided, hmm, I wouldn't mind doing that because I love that Liam kit. Um, she's got two of them. I, I think that the second one is not out yet. The mouth is different. And I like that one better than the first one. So I guess that's going to be the second edition. But for the most part, I didn't have any intentions on having a lot of dolls. I This, this, this reborn stuff is so addictive. I did, I mean, you just keep looking at the kids and you know, like, oh, this is so cute. Oh, this is so cute. Before you know it, you got a mountain of kids. And my place is small, but trust and believe. Sharon T. She got a plan. 
even though after I get all the kids together, I'm going to have like 14 dolls. But there's still some more kids out there, just a few, that's got, I, I just think they're so adorable, and I know I'm going to eventually get it. But I am planning on moving, so I will have a bigger place. But I, I love dolls. I've, I've always loved dolls. I don't know what, I don't want to do um, the changing thing on, because I really don't. I make twins and I change their clothes and then I just lay them down. I don't really mess with them. But I think that I will bond better with a bigger baby, like a toddler. We'll see, right? But my passion is music. And um, I got to figure out a way how I can be comfortable playing my keyboards. Um, My injury, I was at work. And elevator door just smashed my shoulder. You probably can't. There's a few little scars. But I've had two surgeries on my shoulder. I have, um, you probably can't see it. But on my elbow and on my hand, it really, really did mess me up. It, I have nerve damage real bad. In, in my left arm so sitting for long periods of time it bothers me standing like in one place for periods of time it bothers me um I can't ever go enjoy walking cause you know how you walk and your arm kinda sways that bothers me so it has really changed my life um i stumble a lot of people probably think oh she's drunk or no I'm not drunk your arms give you your balance so my balance is off but um I'm going to figure out a way to get back on my keyboards because I just look at them and I kind of like get depressed and like my brother he, he plays bass and he told me he said Sharon get your butt back on those boards he tells me that all the time get back on those boards so I'm gonna figure it out and you know try to make myself comfortable and this accident has really really you know where I've taken things for granted you know it bothers me like when I tie shoes it bothers my hand so I have to buy shoes that I can just slip my foot in. Or if I want to wear, you know, well, jeans and putting a belt on, I have to put the belt, thread the belt through the pants and then put them on. Um, sweeping, that sweeping motion, that bothers me. So I have to get a dust mop so I can just push. Um, what else? Mopping ringing out the mop I can't do that anymore so I have this a friend of mine bought me this bucket and it has like a pedal on it and the the mop head is round and you put it down in this thing and you um mash down on the pedal and it rings out the mop you know and like cleaning out the tub well what I do is spray the tub down real good with disinfected and bleach and stuff and I went and bought an extra toilet brush so you know you learn to improvise you you learn to improvise it is it's just different you just learn to do it and I have to comp you know I'm overusing my right arm because I'm Oh, I'm compensating for what I can't do with my left. So now my right arm is starting to bother me, and I know, I know something's wrong with it. Um, and I, I don't want to do have surgery on that because I'm right-handed. So I go to a pain clinic and I get injections in both shoulders, and believe me, it is very, very painful. Now, I don't know, they're cracking down. It's, it's an epidemic with um, 
opioids and um, they had me on Percocet 10s, but you know, people been ODing and stuff and um, the drug, the street drugs, I mean, they're going to go, they're going to make some money and a lot of people are going to go, go out on the streets to find drugs, but they took me off my pain pills and put me on a fentanyl patch and I am terrified of that patch I am terrified I have to go pick those up tomorrow and um, start using this patch but I've had a patch before but it wasn't a fentanyl patch but that gel inside the, the patch it I was itching so bad I couldn't handle it they had to take me off of it because I my skin is real sensitive so I don't know what they are gonna do with me and I can't worry about it you know I know God's got me I can't worry about it so I think what they're trying to do um, the president has declared war on opioids and it's everywhere all the states rappers rapping about it you know it's, it's an epidemic it really is and some of the people that I go to the clinic with you know I'll be talking to them I'm really concerned for them because they're worse off. They're worse than me, and I just wish the best, but it's going to be dangerous out there, so y'all better be careful because it's coming. So, that's basically it. I'm just doing my baby. I can't wait till she's done. Let me show you her face. I started the outline of one of her eyebrows. So I, I, my plan is to finish the, her baby hairs and to work on her eyebrows. And she has a pretty arch to her eyebrows, her eyebrow bone. So eyebrow, I, I, like, I like doing eyebrows. So I'm gonna, I want to do that, do her other eyebrow. And then I'll probably just watch movies or something. Because this is what I do. I'm up all night because I be hurting. I don't know what it is. You know, when you're sick, you get worse at night. So I've taken my pain medicine. So if I sound a little sluggish or slurred, that's why. But um, I'll be up. And then in, during the day, I'll be sleep. I'll, I'll be asleep. But anyway, Reborn family, y'all keep those videos coming because I really do enjoy them. And I'm learning from y'all, so y'all keep keep it going for you, Sharon T. Um, that's about it. I'm getting ready to sign out. Um, remember to build up. Let's not tear down. Don't hate. Congratulate. Thumbs up. Comment. Be nice and I'll be nice to you. Share. I love y'all reborn family. Peace out.